we are so bitterly divided, even from our own friends and family, the question now is, how do we move forward? Bishop Greg Rickles with the Episcopal Diocese of Olympia, and he just held an election prayer vigil on this very topic. His advice, try to look past the difference of opinion and focus instead on the relationship itself. Aggressively repairing relationships is key. And the only way that's going to happen is if we do it, if we're the ones who take the step, we're the ones who initiate it. If you want to find the solution or the beginning of the solution of any of these issues, look in the mirror. Uh, I think you'll find the beginning right there. I really love what he has to say about this, the idea of not being like, it's your fault. Right. I'm right. mad at you about the whatever. Yes. Or I'm the, I'm glo it, you know, it's about saying, how could I reach out and befriend you even if we have differing opinions? Yes. I think that's a beautiful thing. Where to be can we all start? And if each of us do that, think about how much positivity it can impact on the rest of the world. That's right. Eventually. So whether you're winning or losing this morning, happy or sad, maybe think about a way to reach out and be like, hey, I love you today. Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. I like it.